Initializing Dream Ninja SI. Hey everyone, I recently posted a video of a video playing on startup on the infotainment system here, and a lot of you reached out asking how you could do that yourself. And um, you can do this by installing Honda Hack, and I'll go into details on how to do that in this video. First thing, you see a couple more apps than you normally do here. Usually they're not there. Those are installed through Honda Hack. So you would use Honda Hack to install the Play Store. And then from there, you can install whatever you like. You can install YouTube or other apps that you want to use. You just hook up your Wi-Fi and go ahead and use it. So let's get into how we can install Honda Hack and then uh, get you to a point where you can install your own startup video. First step is to go to the Honda Hack website. So go to autohack.org and you'll land on the home page. You can read some of the information that's there. You can do this on your tablet or you can do it on your phone, um, on your computer, it doesn't matter. And once you're ready to purchase, click on how to purchase. And it'll take you to this page where you could pick the basic version or the pro version. I believe the pro version is $25. Once you land on the next page, you'll see that you have an option to buy now and the uh, amount is $25. So go ahead and purchase that. Make sure you provide a valid email address, which is where uh, they will send you the code, activation code that you need to activate from your infotainment system. When you do click buy now, you do get a couple options. I recommend you click PayPal and pay through PayPal and make sure you provide the correct email address. I believe it'll use the email address that's attached to your PayPal. So be careful on that. Once you're ready to install Honda Hack on your infotainment system, go back to the website, go back to home, and go a little bit further down and click on Civic 10th Gen. It'll give you instructions on how to do this. You can watch this video or you can follow these instructions, it doesn't matter. Um, all the instructions are in this video so I will show you the steps that they don't show you as well so the first step is to connect your um, infotainment system to Wi-Fi so let's cut to that on your system click on settings go to Bluetooth and Wi-Fi and then make sure Wi-Fi status is set to on and go to Wi-Fi device list. Once you go there, you can pick the Wi-Fi that you want. I brought the car closer to my house and connected to my home Wi-Fi. You could do that as well or you could connect to a hotspot on your phone. The second step the instructions ask you to do is launch the browser. This is where it gets a little tricky. Not tricky, I guess it's a hidden step that it references another video uh, on the list of instructions. So I can just do that here for you so it's all in one video. So go ahead and click on the menu for apps and here you should see I believe three apps that are standard that are here already but you might not see the browser. So to do that we need to take a few steps to get the browser to show up Alright, to get the browser to show up, we need to do a couple of steps. So first we want to hold down the brightness button, the audio button, and the menu button. So let's go ahead and do that. Alright, so once the hidden menu shows up, you want to click on Detail Information and Settings. Once you're here, hold down the menu button for about 5 seconds and it should go into a new new menu. And here you want to uh, go all the way down till you see special function settings. Once you're in special function settings, you want to click on cancel Android restriction. So once you hit that, you can return back all the way and wait for the screen to load and go back into your apps and you should see the browser app. Once you're able to pull up the browser, go ahead and go to autohack.org forward slash root. Once the page loads, go ahead and click on get start and just follow through the instructions on the screen. 
Uh, once it's done doing its thing, it'll ask you for the code to activate. Go ahead and provide that code. And once it's done, you will see the Honda Hack application installed in the apps section. Alright, so once you have the app, go ahead and launch it. And once you're in here, you can customize uh, various different things. Um, so go through it, you know, take your time. But I'll show you how to set a startup video and as well as how to download the Play Store. So first off, startup video is under startup settings. And you can select which startup video you want. So they give you a couple options. You can do um, an online video and it'll download for you or right onto the unit. And they have uh, various different options here that you can go through and select. Uh, you could do a local video, so you would have to upload it to your unit and select it. So you would do that here. And right now I have one selected. The way that I got my video on here is by downloading the um, Google Play Store. And from the Play Store I downloaded Google Drive and I just uploaded my video to Google Drive and downloaded it onto the unit um, while staying connected to Wi-Fi. So you can do that by going to install, uninstall apps. In here you want to go to install apps online. Here you want to download or install Google Play services. Once you have that, you can go into the Play Store and download whatever app you want. And in this case, for my video, I just used Google Drive. And um, from there, you can just download your video. It'll save inside of downloads, I believe. And there you go. There's just one item there. It's just that video that I, I downloaded. And that comes up inside of Honda Hack when you try to go select it. A lot of you did hit me up uh, asking how you could do a similar video. Uh, the one that I did was pretty time consuming and I had to do a couple of things to get um, Cortana to say whatever I wanted her to say. Um, but I do know someone that does make these videos, it's really high quality videos, um, and he's been doing it for um, a little bit now. Um, so I will refer you to him. Um, his uh, at on Instagram is one in blue. Uh, I will put that in the description. Um, he's a buddy of mine and he will take care of you if you want uh, a video done by him. You can go to his page and look at some of the examples he's got posted up there. He's done it for a few people. Uh, so uh, I leave you in good hands.